So this video is just a quick review of the shoelace formula that we did in class today. So the shoelace formula is used to find area of um, a triangle. And uh, for this, let's just, and these are just the problems we did in class today, just redoing them. So if you wanted a little more reinforcement. Uh, so let's just get our points down. So the first thing we wanted to do is just stack our coordinates on top of one another. It doesn't matter where you start, you just need to go in a counterclockwise direction. So I'm just going to start at A, and we'll stack them on top of one, one another. Negative 3, 2, 2, negative 1, 3, 1, and then we'll repeat the first coordinate, negative 3, 2. And then we'll just rewrite it again negative 3, 2, 2, negative 1, 3, 1, and negative 3, 2. So now to find the area using the shoelace method, what we do is we say, okay, well, area is going to be 1 half of the sum of negative 1 times negative 1 plus 2 times 1 plus 3 times 2 minus the sum of 2 times 2 plus 3 times negative 1 plus negative 3 times 1. And I think you could see where the term shoelace method comes from. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, do this arithmetic. So negative 3 times negative 1 is 3. 2 times 1 is 2. 3 times 2 is 6. So 3 plus 2 plus 6 minus 2 times 2 is 4, 3 times negative 1 is negative 3, negative 3 times 1 is negative 3. So now let's just simplify this. 1 half of 11 minus negative 2. So that is 1 half of 13. So your final answer, depending on how you want to write it, could be 13 divided by 2 or 6 and a half square units. So either way is fine how you want to express it. So let's take a look at the other example we did in class. And we'll do this again using the shoelace method. So we'll just label our points 7, 4, 1, 1 and 9, 0. So we'll stack up our coordinates and again it doesn't matter where you start just need to go in a counterclockwise direction. Alright, so 7, 4, 1, 1, 9, 0 and we'll repeat, repeat 7, 4 again. Same thing over here, 7, 4, 1, 1, 9, 0 and 7, 4. So it helps if you're neat and organized when you do this. It'll just make things easier. So 7 times 1 plus 1 times 0 plus 9 times 4 minus 4 times 1 plus 9 times 1 plus 7 times 0. And then it's going to be half of that answer. So half of... 7 times 1 is 7, 1 times 0 is 0, 9 times 4 is 36, minus 4 times 1 is 4, 9 times 1 is 9, 7 times 0 is 0. Simplify this. So half of 43 minus 13 and that's going to be half of 30. And this works out nicely. Half of 30 is 15. So our answer is 15 square units. And that is how you find area using the shoelace method.